A decade of suspension, the Arab League foreign ministers decided yesterday to readmit the Syrian regime, altering a regional push to normalize relations with Bashar al-Assad. Following a bloody crackdown on peaceful street protests against Assad, Syria's membership in the Arab League was suspended in 2011. At many Arab states, we drew the envoys from Damascus. On Sunday, after more than 12 years of war and atrocities that have killed nearly a million people and uprooted half the country's pre-war population of 23 million, several Arab countries, including Saudi Arabia, Egypt and others, have resumed high-level visits and meetings with Bashar al-Assad. At a press conference in Cairo on Sunday, Arab League Secretary General Ahmed Abu Ghait stated, The restoration of Syria does not imply normalization of relations between Arab countries and Syria. Each country has the right to decide. There will be conversations in the coming days about the pace and conditions for normalizing relations with the regime. However, there is still no Arab consensus or normalization with Damascus. Several governments did not attend the meeting. Among the most notable absentees was Qatar, which continues to back groups against Bashar al-Assad's regime and continues to resist normalization with Damascus. There are innocent people in prisons. There are many things. We don't want to impose solutions on the Syrian people. The people need to reach them. There must be a political solution to the Syrian crisis.